Shalom and shalom to everybody that's tuned in to this video. Want to give you a warm welcome. Today we're going to be talking about seven ways to praise Yah in Hebrew. And we're going to pick up right where we left off from my last video. It takes seven days for a seed to take root and sprout. And we're looking up seven ways to praise Yah. So we're going to have a praise for every day. And the seed that I'm planting today will be able to take root. Let's try to let's try to do at least one praise a day. Uh, let's go ahead and jump right into it. We're going to be looking up the definition of praise. And the definition of praise is to express warm approval or admiration of. And the second one says the expression or of approval or admiration for someone or something. Uh, and the, an example they give, the audience was full of praise for the whole production. Um, let's see some similar words. Is applaud, pray tribute to, speak highly of, compliment, congratulate, celebrate, sing praises of, praise to the skies, rave about. Um, basically, you know, like clapping hands, uh, be cheer, cheer, or cheer somebody, pat on the back. So, as we can see, that's the definition of praise, a simple Google search, and that'll pop up. I want to take note of how prayer and praise are very, are very similar. Prayer and praise. You know, we pray for what we want, but we can praise y'all for stuff that we, we didn't necessarily pray for that we got. You know, uh, like, you know, I, I know people don't, you know, some people probably do, but most people probably don't pray uh, every day for the air that we breathe uh, or, the, or the moon to shine and stuff like that, that, you know, seem simple because it just happens every day. Instead, we pray for, uh, money and we pray for a roof over our head and stuff like that but really we got everything that we really need because that's how the most high has created this this earth so first we're going to jump right into the first word of hebrew in the in praising which is tauda tauda Tauda, sacrifice, expressed in the Mosaic Law offering, Yahshua, example of being a living sacrifice to Elohim. Tauda, and we're going to be looking up, let's look up Romans 12.1. Romans 12.1, I'm going to be using the Besorah, and it's on page 12.04 in your Besorah. Romans 12, 1. And it says, I call upon you, therefore, brothers, through the compassion of Elohim, to present your bodies a living offering, set apart, well-pleasing to Elohim, your reasonable worship. So we can see that we need to present our bodies a living offering to the Most High. Let's go ahead and look up our second word, which is Yada. 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 Lifting of hands. Reaching out to Elohim. 
declaring our dependence on him and proclaiming our love for our father. And let's go ahead and look up 1 Timothy 2.8. 1 Timothy 2.8. And that's on page 1261 in your Basora. And it says, so I resolve that the men pray everywhere, lifting up hands that are set apart without wrath and disputing. So we can see that we should pray everywhere, lifting up hands. Everybody. Let's go ahead and jump into the third word, which is. Barakarush. Barak Barush, Barak Barush, bowing, bowing, giving reference to Elohim in recognition of his holiness and sovereignty over everything that lives, over everything that lives. Let's go ahead and look the scripture up. We're going to be looking up Exodus 34, 8. Let's go to Exodus 34, 8, which is on page 140. In the basaur. And it says, And Mosea hurried and bowed himself to the earth and did obstance. Mosea is the Hebrew word for Moses. So Moses hurried and bowed himself toward the earth and did office. So as we can see again, let's go to our fourth word, which is Shabbat. 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 Shout to lift up your voice and praise Elohim with all of one's might. To lift up your voice and praise Elohim with all of one's might. Shabbat. That's a good one. Let's go ahead and look. Psalms 47.1. Psalms 47.1. And that's going to be on page 747. And it says, oh, clap your hands, all you peoples, shout to Elohim with a voice of singing. That's a good one. That's a real good one. I like that one. Let's go ahead and look our fifth word up, which is Zama. 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 Sing. Play instruments. Sling slash play instruments. Playing music to express joy in Elohim's presence. That's a good one. That's a good one. Let's go ahead and stay in Psalms and look. Psalms 150, 3 verse 5. 3 through, three through 5. Uh, and that's going to be on page... 809. It's going to be your last songs. The last songs. 150. Verse 3. Let's just read the whole 150. How about that? Psalms 150. Let's read the whole 150. Praise Yah. Praise El in his set apart place. Praise him in his mighty expanse. Praise him for all his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him with the blowing of a ram's horn. Praise him with the harp and lyre. Praise him with a tam tambourine and dance. 
Praise him with a string instrument and flutes. Praise him with sounding cymbals. Praise Yah. Yeah, that's a good one. I really like that one. Yeah. Let's go to the next word, which is. Hello. 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 Which is short for hallelujah. Hallelujah. Celebrate, boast, rave. And it says here, I knew it was a short word for hallelujah, but root word for hallelujah to express praise for Elohim through physical motion. Dancing. You know. Getting it in. Let's go ahead and look a, that scripture up. We're gonna be let's stay, let's go ahead and look second Samuel. Let's do second Samuel. Um, 2 Samuel 6, 14 through 15, which is 378. Let's go ahead and read that. And thou it dance before Yahuwah with all his might, and Dawid was wearing a linen shoulder garment. He was dancing with all his might. Thus Dawid and all the house of Israel brought up the ark of Yahuwah with shouting and with the sound of a ram's horn. Oh man, that, that must have been a good sight to see uh, Dawid, which is David in Hebrew, dancing with all his might i mean he was he was really getting it in sweating and all you can you can only imagine right let's go ahead and look our final word up which is tehillah 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 and we're gonna go let's let's see what that says sing dance praise use to use many ways to praise elohim all of above. Let's go ahead and look. Isaiah 61, 1, 2, 3. 61, 1 through 3. And it's going to be on page 526. Sixty one, one through three, and it says, The spirit of the master Yahuwah is upon me. Because Yahuwah has anointed me to bring the Besor to the meat, which is the good news. That's what Besor means. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted and proclaim release to the captives and the opening of the prison to those who are bound, to proclaim an acceptable year of Yahuwah and the day of vengeance of our Elohim to confront all who mourn, to appoint unto those who mourn in Tyson, to give them embezzlement for ashes, the oil of joy for mourning, the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness. They shall be called trees of righteousness, a planting of Yahuwah to be adored. So that's what I'm called here to do right now is to plant this seed of praise. We got a, a way to praise y'all every day. So that seed will take its root and sprout. And I got something special for y'all. I'm going to go ahead and start off with a praise today right now 
Go ahead and praise y'all. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. How much I love you. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. I love you. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. I sing praise. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. I love you. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. Oh, Yahoo. I sing praise. All right, y'all.